nine world champion Vernon Viper Park. First of all, I'd like to thank God for giving me this victory. Uh, I have to do more thank you. Uh, I have to thank Al Mitchell, uh, greatest strategist in, the, in, in boxing, put a great game plan together. I must say thank you to uh, uh, Buddy McGirt, best trainer in the business. Uh, I also put a good gambling plan together. My conditioning uh, 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 guy, uh, Charles Watson, and Dr. Uh, uh, Clayton Gibson, he put together a, a tremendous uh, nutritional plan for me. I never had a, 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 a nutritional plan. Uh, from the last fight, I came in, I was six pounds overweight. The exact same thing happened to him, happened to me in Connecticut. But this time, I, uh, I got with Dr. Clayton, put together uh, a great nutritional plan for me. We had a six-week plan. I worked it to the to to the uh, to the key. Uh, we trained three times a day, six days a week for six weeks. You know, I mean, they, they you know, I, they, from five o'clock in the morning to ten o'clock at night, working hard. So, just like Sergio said. Uh, uh, the last fight, he deserved it. I deserve this because I worked my ass off for it. Uh, also, I'd like to thank Adidas. Sh shame this plug, but I got to say Adidas uh, Sports and um, and uh, Iron Head, Iron Head Boxing. Now, for this win, uh, there's two things I want to accomplish in this win, in this, this fight. I want to beat his ass, and I want to knock him out. I beat his ass, but I didn't knock him out. I really wanted that knockout really, really, really bad. He's a very slippery guy. I give him credit for it. He, he got some very, very good defense. But I'm not, I'm, 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 I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be arrogant a little bit because I'm going to tell you how I feel about it. He talked so much shit. In the, I read all his articles. I mean, he really, 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 truly motivated me. I have never been motivated to fight a guy in my life. He, he motivated me more so than anybody I, I ever, ever fought. I wanted this win so, so bad, and I'm happy that it turned out the way it, it turned out. I'm not going to be a gracious winner. I'm going to be an arrogant winner, you know, because he was an arrogant winner when he beat me, you know. So, you know, and we even Stevens. If you want to do it again, want to take off, put up the money, you know, put up the money. I'm a, I, I, fight, for, I fight for championships. This, this was for my legacy. And had I lost this fight, I was done. I say no, I, I, I'm done with boxing. I, if I can't beat a guy like this, I don't need to be fighting. You know, that's just the way I feel. If I can't beat a guy like this, I don't need to be fighting. You know, so, so I am so, so happy. I am, look at my face. It don't look like I've been in the fight. Look at his face. Look at his face. I, listen, y'all just don't understand. I had nightmares after that fight. I mean, I, I, man, I thought I was gonna have to go to you talk about Vince, Vince Young going crazy. I thought I, I might have to go crazy. You know, I, was, I wanted this fight so bad, and I'm happy. I am so happy that the fight turned the way it turned out. Also, let me thank uh, Gary Shaw and uh, Al Heyman. Those guys did a great job. Let me tell you another thing. He didn't want this fight. They didn't want this fight. We had to, we had to, then the threaten lawsuits for them to, to take this fight. So don't, 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 don't listen to the bullshit that, that the Richard over there talking about. <laughs> they didn't, they did not want, they, they did not want this fight. They did not want this fight. We got, we could, we had to be, we had to be diplomatic about it. We had to be, be diplomatic about it and not say anything. They, they didn't want this fight. If they want the next fight, we'll take the next fight and we'll do it again. We'll do it ready, do it again right here in the MGM with, with, with Golden Boy, let Golden Boy do it again. Hey, and, and we can make it happen again. Hey, I can go, I can ramble all night long. I got a lot of pent up frustration in me. That's why I'm cussing. Hey, hey, forgive me, but I have a lot, a lot of uh, 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 pent up frustration, and, and I had a big lucky on my back. I had an eight, 800 pound gorilla on my back, and I'm so happy it's off my back right now. I apologize for my language. I, I, I truly am. I, I, I apologize, but I, this, those are just some of the things that I had in my, my mind and in my chest that I had to get off. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, one more thing. One thing. One more thing. One more thing. Since, since Dylan Hoyt is fighting Pacquiao, then won't they let me fight one more chance for my next fight? <laughs> <laughs> Same thing. <laughs>